Awesome. Are y'all ready to rip? Let's, Let's do, do it, it, baby. Here, y'all follow me. Guys, we got one, two, three, four, five 300s out here today. One is a Kawasaki Bayou 300 that's super clean that uh, Josh actually brung out who sold me the super clean 300 that Miller's on. He brung out two 300s today and uh, it should be a good freaking day, boys. The 300 these guys now super clean. We got <laughs> Christian on the blue one that has no brakes. He's definitely gonna wreck the day. So you guys gotta stay tuned for that. It's probably gonna be the thumbnail and title. Christian dies on $400 four-wheeler. I'm going way too fast for this thing not to have brakes. Look at this. Next, there's no brakes. No brakes on this thing. The blue four-wheeler has no brakes. FYI. How you doing with no brakes? Uh, I'm I'm doing. Dang, that thing get hot. Yeah, I told oh you. Oh my god. That sucker's getting hot, son. Oh my goodness. Maybe it'll blow up today. I'm ready to wrap. Let's go do it. <laughs> I got no clue where we're going. Looks like I'm going to lead the pack. It is my property, so I guess they don't really know where to go. I grew up. When I first ever started riding four-wheelers, it was on this property. And looking back to where I have gotten, I used to be just like 100% of kids just out here ripping a four-wheeler. You got one or two buddies that have a four-wheeler or two and then we just go out and have the time of our lives and making memories we'll never forget and look at what we have done and accomplished since then man i mean we turned that little that little backyard fun into my whole life man and it's all on youtube everybody loves it i mean literally turned it into a career that is that is insane we'd ride four wheelers over to this pond and go fishing and whatnot man oh my gosh so many good memories i think i'd left them oh there's a blue four wheeler christian's going slow because he doesn't have brakes but like i was saying i just wanted to come down here today and uh, do some old-fashioned riding. We're out where I grew up riding on literally 90s four-wheelers, just ripping and having the time of our lives. It's gonna be such a good day. Go find some mud, find some creeks to play in. Oh my gosh, I can't wait. This thing's definitely gonna fall apart today. And I promise you guys, if this thing goes to roll, I'm jumping off of it. This four-wheeler is not worth me getting hurt. It doesn't ride all that bad, honestly. I mean, Brain's really done a lot of work on this thing. Bro, that exhaust is getting hot. The oil temp light's on. Oh sh! Oh god! Classic! It, it happens all the time. Well, I guess as long as it doesn't fall in front of me, we're good. Because I don't have brakes to stop. <laughs> oh yeah! This is not good. Oh, there it goes. Oh yeah! Back up, Christian! What are you doing? There it goes, Christian! Stop! Why are you just trying to tear it up more? I mean, it's at this point oh my goodness what happened i bet it's the blue foiler it's done for at this point <laughs> here maybe let's try it <sighs> look at that look at that form <laughs> that form <laughs> that is form right there oh it's coming it's coming oh yeah that's it right there just keep keep it going what the hell what happened it bounced up and then it went under the foiler so he just bent it off because oh no well i guess we're not selling that four-wheeler now oh my gosh all that hard work trying to put that damn thing together also the oil temp lights on is that always on yeah okay all let's right. go till it blows up at this point you're a race bike now dude bro you're you gotta be kidding me i hit a good bump and it came off and then it it just progressively got worse oh why didn't you hit the brakes there's oh, no yeah. brakes <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what, the, what the hell gotta love kickstarting i've never had this thing much trouble to start this thing there it is. Bro, I'm not gonna lie, I am a quite upset about that. Like that thing, I've been getting it nice, getting it ready, getting it ready to sell and whatnot, and it finally just got ready to sell. That thing was ready to roll. Nice four-wheeler. Thanks. He doesn't have a front rack now if he has to run into a tree. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm not believing that mess, boys. That thing was ready to be sold. I don't even know how something like that happens, man. Did we forget some bolts or something? Friggin' climbing Mount Everest over here baby definitely don't want to jump that oh yeah oh that's a big jump that always throws me off right there i've hit that on a pit bike <laughs> almost ate it as you guys could only imagine hey just stay up here i'm gonna go check this feeder i got i came out here the other day and got the feeders rolling there's plenty of corn on the ground but it doesn't look like it's a whole whole lot we gotta find some creeks to play in yeah we need to go hit a creek so they cool off oh snake ah! Ah! What is he screaming about? He's so, Christian's gonna die today, dude. Dude, it is so grown up. I gotta get the bush hog out here, baby. I was down here, I was cutting up trees, clearing some trails. I still gotta bring the skitter down here and move the logs. Oh, the mud hole. I gotta hit this mud hole over here. <laughs> gotta play in all the mud. 
<laughs> Keep on rolling, baby. There's one feeder I really want to check because I noticed a bunch of hog sign right by it. And we haven't had hogs in like six or seven years, man. It's been longer than that. It's been like nine or 10 years since we've had hogs. And they weren't even here during season, so we never got to hunt them. So hopefully they've tore up the corn already and we know they're here. One thing about summer is you got all this grown up crap. It's all grown up or everywhere. Christian's gonna rear end me. I'm calling it. Meow. Oh, I got air. I got air. My front at least caught air. Okay, who the hell's parked right there? They busted through the gate to get right here. That's a stolen car. What the heck? Stolen car, 100%. It's gotta be a stolen car. You think so? Uh, anyone home? Hello? Is anybody home? How the hell did they get that sucker in here? That's what I'm trying to You see to how it's out. busted up? Yeah, dude. I was here. It's got a rope hooked up to it too. Yeah, no, I came through here Saturday. So they dropped this thing off here yesterday because it's Monday. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you think it's a hit and run? Why would they dump it here? Airbags went off in it. No way. Wow, dude. Probably we're getting chased by the cops and like maybe like just dipped it here and ran in the woods. I'm, how'd they get through this gate? This gate's locked up. They must have went around this gate. I can fit the defender around this gate. Yeah, they came around the gate. Hey, does it got a tag on it? We're gonna have to call the sheriff's department and tell them the tag number, see if it's reported stolen or not. Yeah, we definitely need to definitely need to get on that. Dude, I was they literally had to put that thing here last night or Sunday. This I mean this is fresh, man. They just put this here. See, I literally I came down this way in the Defender, went down there to a feeder, came out right here and went out here. It was not here Saturday. What kind of car is it? Nissan, Nissan Rogue? It was bought in Ashboro. Damn, if I had my trail cameras in the truck, I could set a trail camera up on it and see if anybody comes back for it. Dude, I got a camera. No, it's not right here. I got a camera 800 yards that way. I'd go rob off the tree and put it right here. So there's, do we put a trail camera on it or do we call the cops and have them come check it out? Maybe do a little bit of both. I mean, this thing could have been used in a murder. We don't know, bro. You never know. Y'all think the keys are in it? Oh. Oh, that's a good yeah check see if the keys are under the seat <laughs> no way 100 percent stolen car 100 percent all right i'm gonna turn it off and get the fuck out of here definitely stolen car 100 <laughs> percent started bro the keys are in it just go park it on the side of the road let somebody else deal with it no way we got an investigation under our hands boys i mean we can pull it out with the 300s for the tow truck oh we can drive it out one month yeah. <laughs> holy shit man the back windows are down which is odd they're cracked that just seems a little off weird to me i mean somebody could be out here <laughs> for all we know yeah no 100 percent. did you guys check the trunk yeah oh, okay. i had a spare tire in it i'd say we just start wrecking it we'll drive it down the trails you know how fucking that'd be such a funny choice for the video bro we just start riding just everybody squat up in the back we just leave the 300s and fucking start riding around in the the oh, nissan i mean dude it's a running car I mean, it's a possibility they were running from the cops whipped it into here and then called somebody and had them pick them up and they're coming back for it i could use another daily driver hey isn't it finders keepers yeah or something like that what you said there's, there's a large knife under the seat. Yeah. No way. Is there a large knife under the seat? The no angle? chance. Oh shit, that's a machete. I would not touch that. If yeah, there's a machete in that. If you're not gonna touch anything, I wouldn't touch that. The murder yeah, weapon? Not touch that Don't one. touch the murder weapon. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's like rule number one. I can't believe the keys are in it. I can't believe that either. What's in there? A sawzall? Uh, Is it a D-Walt? Uh, no. Nope. See, it doesn't make sense why they'd leave that stuff. If it was somebody stealing it, I don't see why they'd leave that. They'd be taking that with them. Yeah, but like, what if they were getting chased by the cops, dude, and they whipped in here, dropped it off, and just ran? That's what I'm saying. That could be it. That had to be. Had to be. It's a high possibility. I mean, look, I doubt the front end was like that before the car was stolen and if it was stolen so they definitely come ra railing through here or who knows didn't maybe they were drunk 20 minutes later someone's coming up hey this is your car what's it doing parked over here spying on my wife what you mean spying on your wife what, I just said. what you mean by that she's been running around on me what she had me running on y'all ain't took fucking videos that put on youtube have you not yet oh my i ain't fucking with nothing I just... all right she says i can't talk to you on the phone uh i'm real busy today I said, well, hell, I'll sit right there in the edge of the woods and I'll see her run her lip when she turns me out. I'm sorry, y'all. No, you're good. No worries, man. I thought I heard some four-wheelers. I said, oh, hell. <laughs> I said, well, 
I figured it might be a bunch of damn youngsters wanting to tear up something or steal, you know. <laughs> All right. Maybe if I do this shit again, I'll put a note on the winter hat. Yeah. I'm just fine on my wife. Nah. Yeah. Take care, man. What in the fuck? No shit. Yeah, dude, what the heck? He just spying on his wife. What in the fuck <laughs> just happened, y'all? <laughs> what did we just run into? What you doing out here? Spying on my, my wife. wife. Like, when he said that, I was like, what? Are you fucking talking about? He looked pretty confident the way he was walking, dude. I thought he was about to pull something out. Yeah, no. I was I was about to walk up there like, all right, dude, like, like let's play. Dude, for a second, I was like, damn, we he's really about to get jumped by all of them. <laughs> yeah, seriously. I couldn't tell how he was, what his uh, memo was almost. What the fuck just happened? What the f was <laughs> what that? What just happened, dude? <laughs> oh, no. We were just standing around. Dude. That was the guy. That was the guy in the picture. Oh, yeah, no, because I cut the cameras because we're waiting on Miller to get back with the main camera. And we've been here for 25 minutes. And I go in there, I open up the center console. There's a picture of that dude. <laughs> that was 100 percent him. What in the hell? Where's his wife at? I guess working over there. She's working. He's sitting at the house. That's what it sounds like, dude. What the heck, bro? Miller's not gonna believe this <laughs> shit. Dude. He's not gonna believe this <laughs> he's shit. He's not gonna believe it. He's, yeah, he's, he's gonna think we wife. fucking hid the car. So. <laughs> dude, I thought he wasn't gonna believe us. You know, finding the key in there. Yeah. And turning right? the car on. <laughs> that was crazy enough. I'm telling you, because I got to talking, I was like, okay, the windows are cracked. The keys in it. There's a power saw in it. And so they're like, so whoever actually, whoever stole it left all this shit. Like, they left the power tools, you know, stuff that's actually useful. And I was like, I don't know. I don't, I, I start, I just started to say before he walked up, I was like, I bet it's somebody working over there, but I have no clue why they're parked right here. Yeah, seriously. Just, and I started thinking that because the windows were cracked and that, that, that stuff was still in it. He didn't say check and he said spying, bro. What in the hell? He said, you ain't putting this on YouTube, are you? <laughs> yeah, not yet. Hell yeah, I am. He said, yeah. not yet. <laughs> not yet. Oh, here comes Bill. Miller. Miller just missed it. He's going back. Where's the car? No one tell. Just be like, what's what car? What car? <laughs> Title: I caught a guy spying on his cheating wife. <laughs> what? <laughs> He's not gonna believe this shit, dude. Howdy, boys. What's up, dude? Wait, where's the car at? What car? What car? Did y'all drive it? Is there the key in it? The key was in it. I started it. Oh, really? Where'd it go? <laughs> <laughs> He won't believe it. He won't believe it. We found a picture in the car that Braden found. Where was it? In the center console? Yeah, it was a Polaroid it of It was this, dude. like, older white guy. And so we, you know, we cut the cameras. We're just kind of hanging out waiting for you to get back. Next thing we know, some guy comes walking. And he looks identical to the picture. And he's in overalls, big, you know, big fucking country boy, bumpkin dude. Braden walks up to him. And he goes, hey, what you doing over here? And he goes, spying on my wife. <laughs> No way! <laughs> spying on my wife? And then he, and Brayden's like, Brayden's like, spying on your wife? He goes, you heard me? And Brayden was walking up to him like, you know, big chest. And this guy looked a little sus. Like, he was like walking up, but he was kind of playing with shit. It looked like he was about to pull something out. So Brayden starts almost, stepping I almost, back. I almost <laughs> bought the Glock, dude. I almost grabbed it you out of the console. Have. I was about to. Us four were about to have to jump this guy. I mean, I like. we were about to have a final. Yeah, I, I, I really he was thought. legit spying on his wife. He said, and you ain't putting this on YouTube, are you? Brayden goes, not yet. <laughs> what you can't make this on? stuff up, dude. You can't make this shit up. And he up. drove it off. Man. Yeah, he just dropped it and drove off. He goes, next time, I'll put a note on the window that says I'm just spying on my wife. <laughs> you know, you're actually messing with me right no. now. No. I wish we were. Bro, I was, did I tell him not to come back? No. I think I did, but I feel like that's so clear. Like, don't come the fuck back. Bro, are you, you gotta be joking me. When honestly, when I thought that, I was like, just Brayden was out here all day Saturday so I thought Brandon planted the car I was like Brandon's dedicated now but no some dude's spying on his wife he goes he goes yeah and I was I was taking a look at her I see her just yapping them jaws and that's <laughs> <laughs> what in the hell you can't make it up dude bro I'm at a loss for words that's the most random sh we've caught on camera in the longest time I, I did somewhat predict it but it didn't work there his wife did why was that thing totaled though is what i'm wondering that thing's trash there's a power saw in it a 12 inch machete what in the hell? all right let's let's ride what in the hell son what in the tarnation was that i came through here saturday and this stuff was not pushed over we normally keep this big log and a post on the ground right here so you can't drive around but i don't have the key to the gate right now i didn't put that post back bro if i would have put that post back he would have hit that bitch oh my gosh but he spot he was fine from the woods look at how far away he was he didn't have a pair of binoculars that is the stupidest crap so we actually used to lease this land right here and they're putting in a new power plant that is wild man look at that four-wheeler there's a brute force 
That is the craziest crap. I cannot believe that, boys. Guys, leave a like for that. That is some of the stupidest crap I think I've ever seen. We're going to keep on ripping, though. We have actually found stolen cars down here that people dump on our land before. Got a video of one time it happened and another time it happened. I was actually uh, in Nebraska at the time, duck hunting. So I wasn't here for it, but the, the cops had to come out, tow it out, yada, 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 on both occasions. Oh, Christian's going to have a fun time on this one. No brakes, going down a hill. These two things do not mix. I'm gonna run down here and check this deer feeder. You can see where the hogs have been in here tearing it up. Doesn't look like the hogs have gotten to it yet. Nope, no brakes, no brakes. How's she running? She's running good, just no brakes. No brakes? Really? I love riding four wheelers. You, you just never know what you're gonna find out here, man. I always carry a handgun on me when I'm out in these woods. On four wheelers, I don't necessarily, especially when we're in a big group, but like, we're not in a big group. I got a handgun on me because you just never know what's going to happen out here, man. I, I feel like that guy's definitely watching this video right now because he definitely knew I had a channel or some shit. Man, look at these beautiful woods. Mm -mm -mm. So we're going to run down here, hit the creek, and head on over to the power line. That should be a good trail. Oh, boy. We're getting down here in the swamp lands now, baby. We're jumping the log. A little creek crossing action. Meow. I guess you just kind of send it. No, nope, not gonna do it. Don't think it's happening. Ah, oh, come on, I'll weekend it up for you. <laughs> My turn. My turn. <laughs> Brit Miller's turn. Yeah, Miller! Don't really know where I'm going right now. I'm kind of lost. Okay, I'm pretty lost. There should be a cr major creek crossing down here somewhere. I just gotta find it. I don't know if we're all gonna be able to get through it or not. It's gotta be like right here somewhere. I'm really trying to be easy on this thing. I don't wanna break it. Over the creek, baby. Over the creek and through the woods. <laughs> ah! We did it. Oh yeah. Yes, sir. That thing's a trooper. Dude, this thing's too clean. Oh, yeah. I don't have brakes. I don't I don't have brakes. Ow! But my feet are the brakes, apparently. I think the trail's that way. Oh, Josh taking the lead. Yes, sir. Once we get down here to this power line, y'all, there's a good mud hole down there that we could all hit. We don't have any straps to pull anybody out. And I don't think anybody's prepared to get muddy today. And I could cook some marshmallows with the heat putting out of this thing. I could cook a steak. <sighs> Ah, ah, that's hot as f son. Ow, ow, the 300 strike, the bite, 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 strikes back. Holy cow, that burnt me. Oh, crocs are not the move. One thing about this trail right here is it normally stays pretty clean. Oh, let's see the beaver swamp. See if it held water throughout summer. Yeah, there's water in there. Oh yeah, there's plenty of water in there. The beavers has built that thing up, son. You can probably shoot ducks in that. Damn beaver cut down this tree and left it in the trail. I want that beaver to build the dam further down that way because he can make the swamp a whole lot bigger and deeper if he did that. But he started up here, I think it's only just one or two. One or two beavers. But see, even down here it's flooded. But that's not even where the dam's at. I wonder if he's building multiple dams. Look, the beaver's been up here. That's a long way from the first original swamp. Maybe the beaver's expanding the dam. Maybe the beaver's making the swamp bigger, who knows? No, they're stuck on a, stuck on a stump. <laughs> I fucked up, help me! Help me, you idiot! Press the gas? Yep. Okay. Oh, teamwork. This thing's smoking bad. Oh, shit. I f***ed up, and this is f***ed up. <laughs> SOS! SOS! This thing's smoking, dude. This thing's about to f Look at it! It's smoking! <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna blow in a second, dude! That's not from the exhaust, that's from the motor! Oh my god, dude, look! Where'd everybody go? Where's it leaking at? Something pop, bro. It's it's leaking all over. From somewhere? <laughs> Uh, also, I got stuck on that thing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know. I just, I was letting it cool off for a second while we figured out this issue and realized it was smoking. That's bad. This thing's going to blow up. Something happened. I, I shut it off just to let it cool down because I noticed it was smoking. Yeah, it's definitely going to blow up. These pistons, or piston rings are going to melt. What the hell happened? Where is everybody? You want to see if you can push that back in there? You see the, uh, the support rod? Oh, my goodness. Something must be wrong. I don't think it's too bad, but you think that's good? Oh, there we go. We got clearance now. 
Oh, there! I hear Braden a mile and a half away. Cause I I tried to go over that. Cause I think so. I thought somebody went over that and I got stuck right there. Bro, they are gone. They must have went the wrong way. This thing's burning down. It's smoking. Sm it was smoking really heavy a second ago. Why does it look like it's been on fire? It probably has. <laughs> it, it probably. probably has. Yeah, you've probably been riding it on fire. No, oh, like there's moisture on that. I, or something. I, I noticed that. Something's busted or something's leaking. Blew through that gasket possibly. You know how funny it would be if this thing burned down right now? Burned down? Burned down and caught the whole woods on fire, you mean? Yeah. That'd be hilarious, That'd be dude. That'd so funny. So That'd be so funny. funny. Good one, Hey, come on! Thanks, dude. <laughs> the jokes, you know. Brian, keep riding it. Fuck it, dude. If it only lasts through this video, oh well, I'll scrap it. Front plastics didn't hold up too good, did they? It's not, it hasn't been smoking that bad. Oh, man, we're letting Miller hop up in the lead. They're having some issues. Miller couldn't get over some log. Christian started overheating. What's new, baby? Oh man, the power line. Should I hit the mud hole? Should I hit the mud hole? Who's one of the guys? We gotta talk someone into it. We don't have a tow rope nowhere. Hey, Christian. What? Go through there. Where? There. Now. Go. Now. Go. Hey, go through there. He's got brand new tires on that sucker. Oh, it's dry as a bone. First all the mud. Run down here and hit the hop in the creek. Maybe cool the bikes off a little bit. See if we can't get down in here somehow. Oh shit. I don't know about that one, Chief. Back her out. Oh shit, what is he doing? Oh dude, he can't be serious. How deep is it? Bro, he's gonna lose the front end on that thing. <laughs> You're kidding me. Oh my gosh. No fucking way. Damn, son. Those fresh tires did work. Son of a gun. Screw that. I got slick, son. They ain't cut out for that shit. I should have wore real shoes. Holy shit, that's going to be burnt. First tee, first tee, first tee, first tee. Go get Josh's camera angle over here. <laughs> nice. He, he's the 300 whisperer. Holy crap, it's hot. I need some water. I need some water. Holy cow, these trails are tight. Well, boys, all the 300s are about to go up for sale, and I know a lot of you guys... Ow! You just hit me, bro. And I know a lot of you guys are going to be upset about it. It is time to sell all the 300s. We have used them up. We have loved them. We have tortured them. We've had fun with them. And we've done a lot of work on them to them. And so now that we've done everything with the 300s we possibly can, we've taken one to eight foot deep. We floated one across the pool. It is 100% time to sell them. I don't know if I'll keep the super nice one that I got or if I'll sell it back to Josh. I haven't quite made up my mind on that yet, but we will figure it out. I know the blue one's got to go. I'll probably let that one go cheap. Now that the front rack is like completely gone. And then this one, I'll probably get a good price for because uh, it is a quality machine <laughs> bro i need to come down here and like clear some trails because this is just ridiculous you're joking we're gonna act like that didn't happen oh my god <laughs> <laughs> let's leave that like that <laughs> I told Josh he was thinking about buying this one, but he wanted me to leave it snorkeled. And I was going to take the snorkel off when I went to sell it. But uh, I was going to redo the snorkel for him anyway. Yeah! Let it eat! Burn it down! Let it eat! <laughs> I think this is where I was wanting to go. It was over here. Oh yeah, 100%. Hey, Christian, let me see your four-wheeler real quick. <laughs> why? What? Why? What do you mean why? Are you taking it in the water? What are you talking about? What are you doing? Braden! <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> you completely failed. Oh, it's fucked. It's fucked. It's so fucked. Hey, you ain't getting that home. It's staying there now. You definitely broke the tire off. Hey, well, welcome to the Red Four Wheeler Club, buddy. I'll be seeing you on the back of my quad. Yep. <laughs> there ain't no way we're getting that back. <laughs> oh shit. Tie rod in. Why do we buy cheap tie rod in? Why did we? I wasn't expecting the tie rods to break doing that. I mean, I was expecting, you know, maybe it to flip over, you know, something cool, but tie rod, dude. That's it. That's all the destruction we get. I don't know if there's any fixing that one to get it out of here. Bro, this water feels amazing. Yeah, it looks like a clean snap. <laughs> I guess you play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. I guess I deserve that one. Someone steer that tire straight? Yeah, thank you. Hey, somebody keep that wheel straight. Get that wheel. Oh, well, that's fun. More shit to fix. Probably the worst investment I ever made. We've broke a lot of shit today. Including an older man's heart. Oh. <laughs> 
I mean, what I really want is the wheels and tires. Hey, you want to buy it? We'll make a deal right now. Come on. He's offering you 300 <laughs> Come on. I bought it for 400 I put like $1,500 in parts in it. Brand new top end. I mean, this guy got, got a lot of money in it. Let's make let's make this sell right here, for right now. All right, boys. We're going to go back to the truck. We got a rescue mission now. I wanted to make some funny content, and then it just stuck in... <laughs> it went off. It went off that. It stuck the ground like it was an arrow, son. I was like, oh, no. I seen those, those tires go different directions. I was like, you're kidding. I knew it was going to break today, but damn. Oh, we're going to have to fight like hell to get that puppy out. Maybe Josh will buy all three. I'm trying to make the sale work, son. I'd like to, for Josh to have them. I kind of want to keep the keep the one though, but you know, money's money. Get out of here, freaking branch! I got it. I hit a tree. Hold on, back it up. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah, we gotta go get some uh, rescue equipment to get that puppy out of here now. So we gotta have to run on back to the truck. Woo -wee, I'm ready to have a drink, son. It is hot. Ugh. I need something to drink. We gotta go rescue a damn four-wheeler now. Alright, time to go rescue a four-wheeler. Oh my gosh. Josh actually lives about two hours from the deer club. And I'm about 45 minutes from the deer club. And it sounds like he's gonna go ahead and come over to my house. And uh, go ahead and buy this thing right here. But uh, we gotta go in here and rescue this other four-wheeler. So, let's go see if we can't grab it. Today has just been freaking wild, man. Probably just go ahead and follow my old track. <laughs> it's gonna, we're gonna fight like hell getting a four-wheeler through here. It's like it fell back down into the creek. Alright, that four-wheeler shit, there it is. Is this a uh, founder? Oh my goodness, this is so dumb. Why'd I do this in the first place? All right, this should be fun. All right, just the two of us. <laughs> two, three. Let's see here. Stand it up and drop it back down. Here, I'm gonna push down on the back, make sure it doesn't roll. All right, all right. I need to get it on there further. Hope it don't fall off. Probably should have grabbed more ratchets than this. Rescue mission for the boys. That's tight as fuck. Got that strap on. He's putting on another one. See, so bring a third. Yeah, it definitely shouldn't go nowhere. It might flip the four wheeler, but hey, it is what it is, bud. I hope we can, I hope it makes it. Probably could have tied up the tie rod and got it out somehow like that. But oh yeah, it's a solid. It's one unit now, 100%. All right, let's roll, baby. My balance is all off. <laughs> We're moving though, even though I can barely turn. Look at that tire. <laughs> oh shit if we had a clean cut trail we might could get this thing out i don't think we're gonna make it oh i got this tire scratching my back oh shit this is so awkward dude i mean we're making way boys we are making way the 300 is coming out of these woods it just tips me over and rolls me right here oh my gosh all right i'm nervous about this it's gonna pop me up into a wheelie you gotta push me there it is ah <laughs> it about took me this is trouble oh this is gonna be tight holy crap this strap oh gosh it's way loose yeah this one came undone i don't know how you had it i think we got through the most of the struggle though i feel like i'm gonna roll at any given point because i got a lot of weight up high and weight dragging behind me it's just a situation to roll a four-wheeler all right this is gonna be bad there it is <laughs> there's one spot up here that we probably will roll this sucker because I about rolled it without the freaking four-wheeler on the back. I don't, I, yeah, it's hard to see in all this grass where it's at. Oh my gosh. Oh, dude, there's no way. Oh, I just took out the tree. I'm going in reverse. See if we roll it. <laughs> yeah. There it is. I think we made it. I think we're in the clear now. Holy crap. The 300 is rescuing the other 300. This is ridiculous. Any cars? We're good. Ah, uh, home stretch, baby. Home stretch. That is what I'm talking about. Look at that tire spinning. The four wheel drive through us for a loop, but we got it. Hell yeah. That is what I'm talking about. So like I was saying, I think Josh is coming over to the house. I think he's going to go ahead and buy this four wheeler and put a down payment on the other red one. So then we got to figure out what we're going to do with this blue four wheeler. If you guys have any ideas, you want me to sell it, blow it up, put it down in the comments. But uh, we rolling back up to the truck now. What a day it has been, man. So much fun. Breaking four wheelers, running into the cheating freaking wives and crap. Should we, should we tow it home like that? Oh my gosh, it's on the trailer. That was a task. 
Oh, we're on a strap like that. We're ready to roll, baby. Yes, sir. Holy crap, what a sight. This is what happens. Broken snorkel, broken tie rod, destroyed front rack and fender. The mint one's still mint. We take care of this puppy. She's my little baby. Might be Josh's though. I don't know yet. Guys, I gotta go ahead and strap up this trailer. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the thumbs up. Go ahead, like, subscribe. Uh, tell us what your thoughts about the crazy man. That's, that's the stupidest shit I've ever seen. Like and subscribe. We'll catch y'all on the next one.